But when I really got into it, I saw my savings account draining, 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 draining. That's when shit got real. Expecting it to be easy is what makes it harder than it is. That's a quote by Alex and Rosie that I heard on a podcast. And I'll leave the link below on what podcast I was watching there. But this got me thinking when I was riding my bicycle outside and why a lot of people quit on the way to the next step of getting to their goals or why people tend to blame others for their lack of success. Why people tend to blame other things, why people tend to make so many excuses and why it's not for them. You're going to go through so many ups and downs, always, always, always. When I first joined or when I first became an entrepreneur, I didn't expect for it to be easy. And I also didn't expect for, for it to be as difficult. When I first started, my idea of success was working hard to make a lot of money to help my family, to achieve my goals, to do cool stuff like travel, buy nice things, etc. When I really got into it, I saw my savings account draining, 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 draining. That's when shit got real. That's when I was like, oh, it's actually not that easy. And I, I, I had somewhat of expectations for it to be somewhat very simple because I have a very I have high motivation. I have high expectations for myself as far as to do more than others, because in any other companies I've worked with, I've always been the top three or number one in the company. So for me, it's like, oh, OK, that means I can do better than most. That means I'm OK working more than others. So just listen again, listening to that quote when Alex Ramosi said that it was like, bingo, that makes sense. That's why a lot of people quit. That's why a lot of people don't reach the next level in their business or their life or the success, etc. Whatever they tend to want to chase in the future to better themselves, they always quit halfway there or maybe not even halfway there. Maybe they're 5% there and they're already quitting because it's very uncomfortable. Think about it. It's easy. It's simple just to be lazy. It's simple to not be healthy. It's simple not to chase your dream. It's simple not to um, go through a lawsuit. It's simple not to hear other people judge you by the actions you're taking, etc. It's so easy to do so. And, you know, I can tell there's going to be a lot of people who are here instantly. They're going to drop in the comment. Oh, uh, success is not all about money. Success is not blah, 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 blah. Okay, cool. Well, good for you. What I can tell you is being broke causes a lot more pain than having money in your account. At least from my experience, everyone has a different story. My story is completely different. So this is what I'm sharing with you. Okay. I've had situations where I couldn't even financially help a family member going through a very tough time. That hurts. Okay. When I can go help them financially, get out the very tough situation, that brings them joy and that brings me joy. That gives me a purpose to continue working harder every single day. So it's just my story. It doesn't have to connect with everyone. Okay. I'm, I know for a fact, I'm going to go through a lot of hard times. I know I'm going to go through a lot of ups and downs, mostly down. Mostly is going to be all hurdles. Perhaps 10% of everything I'm doing every single day. It's what's going to make it all worth it for me. Just that little 10%. The 90%, I'll take it. I'll sign up for it. Okay. Now, people want to have the reverse. They want to, they want to be, um, they want to work, they want to work just that 10% to have 90% of misery, to have 90% of problems, to have 90% of not having enough financial stability to help their families. You don't see that it's costing you your ignorance. It's costing you every single day. So that's it for me. Just wanted to throw it out there. It was the top of my mind. Wanted to release that. I'm just going to record. Just let it all out. I'm going to record. And if this brings value to someone out there, leave a comment, like, subscribe. It's going to help me grow and continue growing and make more content. If this didn't bring you the value, 
and just don't like it don't comment and if you want to put something negative so be it and it's still going to help the algorithm